Welcome back to my Let's Play for Pokemon Heart Gold, my mono-electric run. I suppose it's time to collect our Master Ball. Oh, I found all eight badges alright. It's a bit of a pain in the butt, but manageable. Okay, now. Wow. You really didn't have high expectations for me, did you? It's not like it's that hard to get all eight badges. Seriously. Yeah, I suppose it will catch any Pokemon that fail. My question is, why do they give them to you researchers anyway? Like, do you constantly go out looking for legendary Pokemon like Entei or something? They're like, well, if you find an Entei, here's a Master Ball, so you can just throw it at Entei, like, BAM! Caught it. <sighs> they are, huh? I'm not really looking forward to that. I'm guessing if they're waiting for me there, they have to be, you know, really powerful trainers now. Let's face it, you can't be this late in the game and not be a super powerful trainer. Or I should say, a, a notable trainer, I guess, at this point. They have to be at least level 30-something plus. Uh -huh. That'll make things interesting. I suppose, let's just try and get away safely here. Damn! It's like the game's punishing me for walking through the grass right now. Like, every step I take, it feels like I'm being hit with a random encounter I just don't want. Just leave me alone. <sighs> Seriously? As soon as I get into the grass, bam, another rat's hat attacks. Go away! Seriously? Piss off. I don't know where you came from, but go back to it. Okay. Ugh. Another one. Fine, I'll kill you too. Seriously, I'm getting tired of running from these guys. Wow. They got paralyzed just from touching me. Once. That's what it gets. Of course, they give out so little experience, I can't even see it on my bar. <sighs> I wish I could jump that. If only, if only. It'd really help right now, I'm just saying. Well, let's take out this rat as well while we're at it, just cuz. <sighs> Another one? It's probably gonna be a Rattata, too. The thing's chasing me down like, like a massive pack. A rat pack. And it won't give up. It's starting to get really irritating, ain't it? <sighs> probably another one. I'd be surprised if it's anything else. Called it. Okay. Take that one out. Ah, come on. I just want to get to the city so I can fight the Kimono Girls, you know, because I bet that's why they're waiting for me. And I have to spend a bunch of time dealing with all this random stuff. Go away. Uh, don't leave home without Max Repel, apparently. Uh, it's like they're drawn to me right now, and I don't know why. It's sort of strange. Whenever you want to go somewhere, it seems like that's when everyone has to stop you for a random encounter. But when I'm actually training or looking for fights, I can. it takes a lot longer to find things, it feels like. Or maybe you just feel every encounter and how annoying it is when you know you're trying to get somewhere. There's attacks on all this added time. And you're like, can we just go? Come on. Okay. Like what a whole like three there or so. 
Gosh darn it. Like, whenever I'm in a hurry, this is what happens, I swear. <sighs> now what? Another bell sprout? Get lost, sprout. Seriously. I ain't got time for you. Okay. We're almost there. Not that way, this way. Of course, the problem with fighting the Camilla Girls is they come at you one at a time and only have one Pokemon apiece. Um, so X items aren't going to really help us there. And my supply of powerful healing items is rather limited at the moment. Seriously? Right before I get into the city. Damn you, Hoot Hoot, just go away. Seriously. Yeah, I need a, f a fiery hell for getting in my way. <sighs> Guess we'll hit up the um, Pokemon Center. <sighs> okay, heal my battered and broken bodies. Okay, they're not really that broken, just a bit bruised by one health point, but hey, every hit point counts sometimes, you know? And I guess we should buy some revives while we're here anyway. At least I think they sell revives here. Let's see. Ooh, Hyper Potions. That's cool. I'll take a bunch of these off your hands. I think 10 of them will suffice for now. And... Full restores, huh? Take 10 of those, thank you. And let's see, we got any revives in here? No, we got repels, though. Oh, there's a revive, I missed it. How'd I miss it? Well, if we got one in the bag, I only want ten total. Eh, I think that's good enough for now. Okay. Ouch. My face. <sighs> How? Because they have Eevee power, man. And Eevee power is not to be underestimated. You can make an entire team with Eevees. Okay, probably won't be the best team. But you can definitely make a team with them. Um, and probably cover just about every weakness you can think of. There's probably better picks, but hey. If you're an Eevee master, you know, you gotta go with the Eevees. One of these days I might do a run like that, but I'd have to do it in a version where I actually can get various Eevee, Eevee evolutions, you know. A bit easier than um, Gen 2 here. You can't just go and buy the water, fire, and um, electric crystals you need. And I don't want to do an entire team with nothing but Espeons and Umbreons. I could, but, you know, I'd like to have as much variety as possible if I'm going to do it. Oh, so that's where Togepi came from. That's cool and all. I guess. I'm ready to be tested to face ho -Oh. Not that we're going to bother with that, but I thought this might be interesting. Hmm. Let's see. Umbreon, huh? Well, at least we can take advantage of our Focus Blast, then. Assuming we don't punch ourselves. Darn. Let's get Neo out there, then. If there's anyone that can absorb Dark Pulses and stuff, then it's gonna be this guy. Um, Spark. Gosh darn it. Shoot. It bounced it back to me despite the fact it got paralyzed through a skill, not by random chance there, but gosh darn it. Yeah, wrong option, sorry. 
I wanted to switch back over to Thor. Hopefully I'm not going to take too much damage for this. Oh, it got paralyzed. I'm lucky. I can come in with another Focus Blast and just finish it off. That went relatively well, I have to admit. Sure we had to share the experience, but hey, I'm willing to do that. Huh. Well... Spark's technically a physical move, and so is this, so... Screech honestly makes more sense than having that on there. Yeah, forget that. And we're gonna learn Screech. Plus it goes in well with things like Thunder Punch and Spark on some of my other Pokémon as well. So, it's not a bad fit for what I need for the moment. Okay, so which one are you gonna bring? Hmm. Well, that's cool and all. But, we take out Umbreon, that leaves four more to go here. Um, Espeon, because it makes sense. Let's see. Charge. Ah, that was ugly. Well then... I hopefully we can survive that. Yeah! By the skin of our teeth! Gosh darn it! I hate Synchronize! It keeps causing me problems. At least we can now finish it off, I guess. Oh, sweet. Thunder Punch. <sighs> oh, yeah. That went relatively well. But that whole um, synchronized stuff still annoys the crap out of me. <laughs> it really does. Do all the Jolteons do it? I'm sorry, uh, Evolutions do it? Ugh. Jolteon's gotta be coming up here soon, though. Hmm. Oh, you're the one that was here, huh? So what do you use? Um... Flareon, Jolteon, or Vaporeon. That's all she's got left is for options here. Uh, there's no way they're gonna save Jolteon for last, so it's gotta be next. Um... Charge, I guess? Yeah. Oh, it tried to burn me! You jerk! How dare you try to burn me! <sighs> Nick succeeded too. A fire blast? Aw, oh, shoot. Well, at least it didn't kill me, I guess. Okay, that takes care of her. Gotta hurry this up. I got pasta on the um, stove right now. <sighs> okay. The one we mapped to the dragon's den. Gotcha. Knew it. There's no way they're gonna save Jolteon for last. It's too awesome. Um... Darn it. Discharge. Okay, I can't use any of my electric attacks here. And I can't use, um... Focus Blast at this point, because it's too evasive. Okay, go Neo then. Okay, it's definitely super evasive at this point. Ah, one of my preferred tactics, most definitely. Um, let's see, bag. I'll use a full restore on it anyway. Just don't have to worry about paralysis coming in, biting me in the butt, hopefully. Of course, not my life, if I cure the paralysis, it's just gonna drop Thunder Wave. Or Thunderbolt will paralyze me. 
Um. Darn it. Jolteon's gonna have to apparently be a massive pain in my backside. I can't seem to get anything off around this thing, practically. Come on, just one more. Thank you. At this point, I don't really care. If I lose Neo, I lose Neo. You know, I did what I wanted to do. I hit it with a couple screeches, so now it's vulnerable to swift attacks. Because it doesn't matter how evasive it is. Gosh darn it. Okay. Jolteon's gonna be a pain in my backside. Ugh. This thing's nasty. Oh, it can absorb electric attacks, but if it gets paralyzed due to an ability, it can still hit it. Gotcha. <laughs> Take my stack touch and die. I'm back. Okay. Man, I didn't think these girls would be this tough. Ugh. They're putting the fear of Eevee into my heart again. <sighs> Come on, one more. Yeah. Okay. Good luck, Billy. You're gonna need it. Of course, now we got the poor hand left. It's the only one available. This should be a much easier fight. I don't care how tough the Porygon thinks it is. Electric attacks will definitely thwart it. <sighs> Any day of the week. Though I may have to heal first. Get rid of burn here. Well, let's see, what's it gonna start off with? Surf, huh? Surprisingly effective. Gosh darn it. HP restores. So I'll take less damage from the next surf attack, but I will lose the power up. I was gonna prepare for a discharge. <sighs> now it's using quick attacks for some reason. Weird. Okay. Well, I don't know why it decided to start touching me. I guess it just felt like having stack discharge afflicted on itself, I guess. Weird. I very just kept surfing on my butt, you know? <sighs> Makes me wish I started out with Billy, because then I could have dropped light screen. <sighs> I don't really don't really feel worthy of it. I use up so many healing items for these fights. You did, huh? Yeah, I'm not gonna go there. I got no reason to. Ugh, not, it's really time to start making our way over to Victory Road for the next episode. But, yeah. Next time, I guess, we'll be making our way over to Victory Road. Because it's already been 20 minutes. Like I said, I got pasta to go catch. Until next time, then. See ya.